Not though winter is on our doorstep and tonight the preparation is on for plow drivers, public works departments and homeowners ahead of tomorrow's snowfall. Sam Kramer joins us live in Waukesha. Sam, your first snow live shot of the year, at least in preparation, is tonight. They're putting away the giant leaf vacuum cleaners that Public Works has and they're trying to protect the morning commute tomorrow. Yes, they're trying to. It's quiet now, at least on the weather front. But the key word is right now, the Highway Patrol Superintendent here in Waukesha County knows the morning commute could get messy. It's why his department spent the entire day getting every truck they have in the fleet ready to go. Also, while a local hardware store helps homeowners just in time for tomorrow. Like traffic on Grandview Boulevard. Another season is about to pass us by, which means work at the Waukesha County Highway Department will change too. It's been kind of controlled chaos on our end. Daniel Modry is the department's patrol superintendent. He spent the last week planning for Tuesday's snow, a first test for what's to come this winter. We're hoping everything goes smooth and uh, at the end of the day, Hopefully the uh, snow won't stick too much to the roads and we can get home at a normal time. On Monday, drivers and other staff equipped every truck with a plow, salter and more, knowing the streets could be slick. There's a lot of different steps and a lot of different moving parts. The same holds true at TNT Ace Hardware, where a flurry of shoppers try to beat the storm. Now that people are finally realizing that snow's actually coming tomorrow, it's definitely been picking up, moving some salt, sold a couple snowblowers already, shovels are starting to fly off. Hoping a little extra effort now will make the cleanup a little easier later on. If you're ready, it's going to make your life a lot easier, not trying to clean out the snow with an old broken handle shovel or a cracked shovel or even a push broom. So if you haven't yet, move that alarm clock in the morning up just a few minutes to allow yourself some extra time. Of course, if you can work from home or remotely, that's not a bad option either. We're live tonight in Waukesha County. Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. You seem very energetic. You seem prepared, Sam. We'll check back in in early March, see how this winter <laughs> treats you. All right, before you call it a night, make sure your phone has the Fox 6 Storm Center app. Track our first snowfall and the temps that'll go with it. The app also has severe weather alerts to keep you in the know no matter your location.